Good day, Royal fans. Today's headline. Meghan Markle is getting a taste of her own medicine from brother. Meghan Markle's half-brother's appearance on Big Brother is giving her a taste of her own medicine. Thomas Markle Jr., who is estranged from Meghan, is a contestant on Big Brother VIP, a celebrity version of the reality TV show in Australia. He has spoken out against Markle several times in the past and in the trailer for the show claimed, I told Prince Harry, I think she's going to ruin your life. She's very shallow. Meghan is also estranged from her ta father, Thomas Sr., and half-sister, Samantha, who have both given interviews about her. Meanwhile, since moving to California from the UK, both Meghan and Harry have given several interviews in which they have talked about the royal family. In their bombshell chat with Oprah Winfrey, she made several accusations against the royals, saying that a family member had questioned what color their son Archie's skin would be before he was born. She also said she had felt suicidal during her pregnancy, but was refused help. Appearing on the Daily Mail's Palace Confidential show, writer and columnist Sarah Vine was asked if she felt sorry for Meghan, given her brother's appearance on the show. But Sarah replied, no. I think she's about to find out what it feels like to have someone cash in on your family, which is what the Queen has been dealing with for the last 18 months. She and Harry have been cashing in on their royal family by cashing in on all sorts of Netflix deals and giving interviews to people and saying dreadful things. It's a taste of your own medicine, I reckon. While journalist Charlotte Griffiths added, the last thing she wants is to be associated with is Big Brother. Meanwhile, just last week, Meghan's dad, Thomas, appeared on GB News in the UK and claimed he had tried to make amends with his daughter. The 77-year-old, who has never met Harry or his grandchildren, Archie and Lilibet, says he sent Meghan a bunch of roses as he tried to mend their broken relationship. But as of yet, he says he's had no response from the former suit star. I really didn't expect to hear back, but I tried nonetheless, he said. He told GB News presenter Dan Wooten, I wished her a happy birthday and brighter days ahead, but I've not heard back. He'll, he also told him, I don't know if he's the one behind it, but I really think that Harry and some of her friends have changed her. I love my daughter, but I don't always like what they're doing. Thank you for watching. Go ahead, like, comment and subscribe.